prefab and fortified. We find that painting's obsolescence, as a useful technology in contemporary society makes it an appropriate site for reflection. Even further, its inherent uselessness makes it a particularly interesting way to reflect on the nature of pragmatism in our society. Since most useful functions in our culture seem to exist to either support or supplement the abstractions of capital or identity, we find that the language of our response must be abstract in kind. This response conspicuously flies in the face of our Western desire to definitively catalog, understand and format the world around us and provide the security our individual identities apparently require. In fact, a question of security looms in our minds, as we make our work simply, because it all seems so fatuous. We find it ironic that so many of us desire utopia, because utopia, quite literally, is nowhere. Given the ambiguous and hybridized cultural landscape in which we exist as Americans, maybe we are already there, in utopia. We are nowhere, as we travel along our highways and shop to satisfy our needs, just as we are no one, the paradoxical individual everyman, plugging into aspects of cultural identity that exist ready-made for us. We are all hybrids, whether it is through communication or technology, and our limits, desires, identities and directions are not fixed. Yet a neurotic quest for a fixed identity and secure values, 